Falcons wide receivers coach Terry Rabisky is a New Orleans native who was a star running back at LSU in the 1970s. He was drafted by the Raiders and played five years in the NFL before beginning a pro coaching career that's lasted 27 years. The fact this is his first season in Atlanta brings irony and emotion. My mother was the biggest Saints fan in the world. Even when I was with the Raiders and we came to New Orleans to play the Saints, my mother pulled for the Saints. I was playing for the Raiders. My mother pulled for the Saints. I was coaching for the Raiders. My mother pulled for the Saints. Okay, so there were times that when I was with the Raiders, I would go home and the Raiders would go down there to play. One night I remember it was a Monday night football game and I went home and my mother cooked a lot of food and I took about 10 or 12 players home. When we got to my mother's house, I'm there with the Raiders, I'm playing with the Raiders, and she had a sign that said, Welcome home, Terry, and on the bottom of the sign it says, Who that? Okay. <laughs> Robisky has had his share of emotional pulls over the last year. His son, Brian, is a wide receiver at Ohio State, who played in New Orleans last January in the national championship game against his dad's alma mater. To be there, to be in the city, and to be a part of that, and to know that my son was playing in it was tremendous. It was a tremendous feeling for me. I had a ton of fun with it, and um, right on through the game, the game, it was it was it was great. Now, you know, I can't sit and say today, I'm happy. Unless you did a good job. Congratulations. Wish him the best. But uh, of course, I wish my son would have won. Robisky's life is filled with football. His middle son Andrew is a freshman offensive lineman for former Falcons coach June Jones at SMU, and his youngest son Kyle plays high school ball. Now Terry is in the NFC South, which means he faces the Saints twice every year. My mom, <laughs> the biggest Saints fan in the world, I'm here in Atlanta, which is in that division. I know she's turned over in her grave a few times. And like I told people when I got here, I want to beat New Orleans. I want to beat them here. And then I want to beat them in New Orleans so I can call my mom and tap on her grave a little bit and say, who that? The Falcons that. We're going to beat them Saints. Terry Rabisky may have left New Orleans, but New Orleans has never left him. You guys can take that down there and give that to, give that to CJ, the receiver coach, and give that to Doug Marron, and go give it to Sean Payton. Tell Sean I sent that to him, and we come into New Orleans, and as a Falcon, we're going to beat them Saints. We'll make All sure right. they see it. Okay. All right. Of course, beneath the laughter, Robisky is very serious.